And welcome, everybody. What is this that I am playing today? Well, it is a Jeezy Doom Total Conversion by Arch. And what exactly is it that we're playing? Well, if you can't tell from the music, the theme music, well, we are playing something pirate related, and that is Pirate Doom. Version 1.8, the most modern version that there is. And this came out a few years ago for GZ Doom. And from what I could tell by looking at the screenshots and maybe just a couple of minutes of footage, this looks absolutely amazing. I just had to play it. Now, it was brought to my attention, um... Actually, a few years ago, I believe so, and I never really looked into it, though I should have, because this looks glorious. Um, the link to everything that you need to play this, what I'm playing right now, is in the description below, so check out those links. Uh, you do need Doom 2 in order to play it. Uh, Doom 2 is not free, though it is dirt cheap on Steam, so no reason to not pick it up. So anyways, enough talking. Let's just jump right in to, um, okay, we got Pirate Doom and we got other maps. Well, let's play Pirate Doom. And we have Shark Bait, uh, Booty Shiner, Rum Guzzler, Cap'n, and Avast. Avast, ye mateys. No, we are not going to play on Avast. Um, we'll play on the difficulty where it was default. Uh, Rum Guzzler, because that sounds like something that Doom Guy would be. He is a Rum Guzzler, so let's just play. Let's just see what we're gonna do. Welcome aboard, Swabby. Huh. <laughs> okay, press Alt Fire to swing ye cutlass. Okay, yeah. It um the text document that came with the download did say that I would need an alternate fire, and this is what it is. It's a cutlass sword, my mateys. And look at that imp down there. He has a hat on. A pirate hat. What does he throw? Not quite sure what that is. Oh my gosh! That is awesome! His hat just flies off. Okay, well, we're on here on the front of the ship. Uh, the bow, I believe. And we need a blue skull to activate the wheel. I was hoping we could take this ship for a ride, but... You know what? This is so cool. Hello, peekaboo, my mateys. You got any rum in there? Oh, never mind. I'll just steal your rum. This is so cool. Like, I mean, just the background with the with the gray mountains and the clouds and the sky contrasting with the blue water down here. It's just incredibly gorgeous. The world is... Oh, it's a little ship down there. It's a little, uh, lifeboat, I guess. Whoa. <laughs> I love that the imp's hat just flies off completely. Oh, we can get inside. Okay, any rum inside here? Oh, but this looks like armor. Hmm. Okay. Well. Oh. No? Oh, it raised up these bars. A chest of bullets. Well, that's always nice to have. Bullets are really handy. Oh, right. Okay, cool. I knew there had to be like a, a hidden switch behind the switch that is so typical of Doom. And we picked up the armor. A secret is revealed. How many enemies? There are 35 enemies. Well, five secrets and 29 items. Okay. And this is... What was it? Map 41 on board. Okay. 41. Um, I believe this also has 18 maps in it, so... Oh, 
What are... <sighs> a beer mug. Healthy. <sighs> oh, I see. So these work like the armor bonuses. Except you know pirates, they don't want a little health vial potion thingamabob. They want beer. Oh, hello there. Wow, one swipe! That's all it takes with the correct movement of the sword. Aha, these are the armor bonuses. I'm not even sure what these are supposed to be. I jibbed him! This works like a berserk pack. Sweet. Ouch. Wine. Wine is good for me health. Yes, it is. Uh, pirate guy. You are now pirate guy. Whoa. I don't know why it does that. These old games tend to just, uh, freeze on Windows 10 sometimes. Which I don't know why. But that's okay, we'll roll with the punches. Like I always say. No, I guess not. I was thinking those were the barrels, like, um, in Original Doom, that you could blow up, but, uh, I guess not. Okay, I still hear some enemies. Oh, um, by the way, about 100%. I'm not gonna go for 100% all the time. I mean, obviously, I would spend an eternity just looking for the secret areas. If I come across them, I come across them. That's just basically what it comes down to. This looks like a treasure, tre a treasure chest. Uh, rum! I can't grab it. That must be health, like, uh... Probably, um, a medikit is what I'm assuming. Okay. I'm just assuming that, though. I <laughs> Look at that hat. That's so cute and adorable. I'm sorry, I have to say that. Oh, we're going down deeper into the bowels of the ship. Okay. Ah, uh -huh, these are the barrels. Okay, I was wondering when the explosive barrels were going to come. Because what pirate movie or video game does not have the explosive gunpowder barrels? You gotta have them. Well, that's a neat spider web. No one's been down here forever. Except these guys, these unfortunate mateys, who are probably tasked with, uh, keeping... Who are probably tasked with keeping the, <laughs> Like, um... I don't know, well, as you see, there's a lot of inventory that they probably have to keep track of. And, uh... You know, for a pirate who just loves to kill, and loves the women, and loves the gold. This is a menial job. Staying down in the bowels of the ship, doing absolutely nothing but guarding absolutely nothing. That would be a horrible job for a pirate. That's why pirates, uh, I guess didn't quite like those types of jobs. Bilge rats, me key has been stolen. No, no. I'm assuming that's the blue key. You guys come from. Whoa. Okay. Is there anything inside here? No. Where are these guys coming from? Is there like a hatch in the floor or something? It's cool, you can see out. You know, this is a typical ship. It has the little windows where you can see out. I was gonna say I'm gonna grab that wine because wine is healthy, but uh, Pirate Guy already has 100% health, so he's all good. Well, I guess that's it. I'm gonna switch to my sword. Not that I'm running a bit low on bullets. I have over 100. It's just that it's kind of fun to use the little sword. The pirate sword. 
Ouch. Who dares strike the captain? The captain. Who struck the captain? Step forward, and I will be merciful to you. I guess nobody. Well, okay. I'm not sure what's going on, but all of these mugs appeared. And these guys in fight with each other, I wonder. <laughs> yes, they can, in fact. Okay, so did I grab the key? No, I did not grab... Whoa. I did not grab the key. That is so cool. This sword works like a berserk pack, which is just absolutely outstanding. I'm assuming since new items spawned, that new item, uh, that the key has also spawned somewhere. But I don't know where. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. Oh, his hat just fell in the water and is at the bottom of the sea. There we go. Now, get back up. Is this like a... Yes, it is like a ladder. That is so cool. Well, okay, I'm missing one enemy and three secret areas. Um, I'm not going to go for 100% all the time, but if I can spend uh, the extra two or three minutes or so just looking for secret areas, I'll do it. You know... I might as well. Oh! A chest of bullets. Those are always nice to have. Bullets are handy. The thing about it is that the secret areas could be anywhere. And... I don't have the option to turn on the secret areas before they are found. I prefer to find them as I find them. Uh, but if I can't find anything, you know, it's not that big of a deal. I want to do as much as I can in around the 30 minutes that I'm giving myself. I may, in fact, just uh, play this whole game in 30-minute increments. You know, just to just to show off the whole game, because I've not played this, and I would love to continue playing this. So, okay, well, I think, I think that's it. I think that's all I can really find uh, within a reasonable time frame, so. On board is finished. With 97% kills and items and 40% secrets. I don't like leaving things on the table like that, but you know what? The goal of this playthrough is not really to find 100%. It's not a walkthrough, it's just a little playthrough, just to have fun. So, let's move on to Melee Island. Oh boy, are we on an island now? Oh my gosh. This is gorgeous. Oh, we are in... Yeah, we're... Okay, we're in that little ship that we grabbed the blue key from. And we sailed just a short distance from the pirate ship over there, except now it is nighttime, as we can see by the moon and the stars. This is just gorgeous. Ye old shipyard. Okay... Oh, I can't go in the water. There is an invisible barrier. Yeah, I can't go inside the water. So, no point in trying. Can I get on this rock? No, I can't. 
Hello there, Mr. Imp Pirate. You are now dead. Uh, you must be a rival pirate that is now dead. Shiver me timbers! You are now dead. Can I get on this rock? No. I don't know if you're allowed to jump in this mod or not. Uh... If I come to a point where I know I'm supposed to jump, then I will edit the controls in order for me to do so, but... For right now, we're just gonna play... Oh my gosh, this is awesome. I am the new pirate here, and I am taking control of this melee island. It is now mine. Hello there. Give me your rum. Give me your women. Hey, there's a piano inside there. What pirate movie or video game or TV show is not complete without a pirate playing the piano? Go ahead and use the sword again. I like the sword. Well, maybe not for these barrels, though. This is just gorgeous. Oh, what does this say? Tonight, monkey wrestling. Okay. That is an interesting... I guess that's what pirates like to do in their spare time, is they like to gather up some monkeys and just have them fight each other to the death? Or is it just like play wrestling where they're just having fun? Uh, knowing hardcore pirates though, it's probably not for fun. It's probably to the death. Poor monkeys, rest in peace. Oh, I can't get inside there. I really want inside. Oh, he dropped a weapon of some kind. Well, I have to get inside there then, don't I? Maybe this door opens up by a switch or something, or it automatically opens up later on. We'll have to find out. <laughs> yes, I am here to take control of the island, where I will institute a brand new law. No more monkey fighting. Instead, we will take all the criminals and have them fight each other for our amusement. Oh, okay. Spinach! Okay, my screen turned a little bit of red, and spinach, if I recall my old-time cartoons, reminds me of, like, Popeye the Sailor Man, where he would eat his spinach and he'd become super strong. It switched to my sword, so I'm assuming this is the Berserk Pack, the spinach. Which, if that's the case, I'm going to jib enemies twice as much. Aha. Oh my goodness, we have the demon. Um, I'm not going to... Is he... Is he firing faster? My guy, my pirate doom guy. I think he's swinging faster too, or is that just my illusion? Am I just going through some sort of an illusion right now? The time is 11.59, probably PM because it is nighttime. I max bullets. Okay, well. Armor, which I don't need. I think the little, the little tiny bonuses are actually keeping me above 100% armor at all times. Which is kind of neat. The... The sound effects and the... The sprite animations reminds me almost of the animations from the knife from Return to Castle Wolfenstein. Just a little bit. How about you guys? Does it remind you of that a little bit? Okay, let's... We gotta take this area piece by piece. 
Otherwise, I'm going to get lost. And I'm not going to know where I'm going, so... Yeah, I think he is firing faster. My guy. Ooh! Is this like the shotgun? I couldn't quite see what the... Yeah, the, I think this is a shotgun. This is cool. <laughs> oh, I'm out of ammo for it, though. I didn't grab any more shells, so... I'll be on the lookout. There's someone in prison. He must have been a criminal. I should have saved him for my arena fights that I'm going to set up. I like that the demons are wearing an eye patch and are dressed in like a blue uh, pants, if you will. Kind of cute. This is just, this is more of a cute mod, I find, but it's also really entertaining and really fun. I didn't realize I'd have this much fun with it. The big doors came down. Yeah, Arch, you really. This is just impressive. I mean, Doom modders really go out of their way to outdo themselves every single time. I mean, this is something I could never even come up with in my mind, let alone make. So this is just so good. I recommend everyone watching to go and play it. Yeah, that uh, spinach must make me fire faster. Or Doom Guy is just getting better at shooting. Who knows? Uh, let's see. Oh, oh, I can't pause now. I like that their hats can just go flying off for several feet. Uh, let's see. So this is map 42, Melee Island, with 77 enemies and 5 secrets and 54 items, so... Not another big map, but... Oh, this is the exit. Okay. Aha, uh -huh, more shells. Well, I am going to save those shells. For when the enemies might get in, like, a large group, or if the enemies get tougher. I'd like to at least sh save my shotgun shells for those particular moments. I wonder, in what era is this set in? Because those street lamps, unless those are like powered by gas or uh, candlelight or however they used to power up the street lamps back then. I'm no expert in how they used to do that. Okay, so where have we not been? Okay, so here is where we came up. Okay, so... Well, I didn't mean to fall down, but... Okay, well, let's take the right path first. Let's just explore all of what there is to see on the right side. Okay, yeah, we... Okay, well... Yeah, I assume the yellow skull. You can't get through there. This looks like it's locked and might open later on, though I'm not sure when or how. We've already been through there. I might go back in there later on if I can't find anything. Been through there. I'm just going to go in the perimeter. I know there's a lot in the center area here, but I'd like to make sure I didn't miss anything in the outside area. Okay, this is a red skull.
Um, I think... Yeah. Okay, now let's... Yeah, I want to get inside this building. Somehow. It's looking like a cool building. Oh! We are meant to get inside there. It has the exit key. Okay, so don't worry about that, Big Mac Davis. We will be able to get inside there. For right now, we need to find probably the red key. Or the blue key. Because I see a red door right there. And I see a blue door right here, which I have the blue key. Okay, well. Let's pay attention. Open sesame. Timbers. Who shot me? Who shot your master? Your future master, you will die. Anyone who will not submit to me will die. Someone is trying to ride this up. And you died because of it. Ha uh ha. -huh. a lot of barrels. I mean, I don't mind blowing up the barrels because they provide a lot of entertainment. Oh, this is cool. This is like a little bridge. We're gonna snipe you off. <laughs> Goodbye, pirate imp. Red key is mine. I know where the red door is. That's kind of cool how everything starts to open up for you as you start exploring more. Okay, red door, where art thou? There you are. Oh, this is a cool place. Well, this is my kind of place, I think. The bar. Oh, give me your shotgun. More ammunition for later usage. Oh, poor little monkey. Probably his last picture taken before he was sent out to the arena to fight. These pirates are so... They got nothing better to do. Oh. Oh. My. Gosh. Okay. How do I grab that? Maybe you are meant to jump. Okay. Well, then. Uh, what do I need the invulnerability for, though? That is... Can I not reopen it? Uh-oh. Well, that's not good. Um... What is my... Q is my jump. Oh, that's right. I did set that. Oh, but I can't jump. It's not letting me jump. Okay, well, I guess you can't jump in this one. Because I'm pressing Q, and he's not jumping, so... And I can't reopen that. Maybe it was a one-time thing. Bummer. Oh well, I'm not going to spend too much time on this. I'll just uh, move on and see why we needed the invulnerability sphere. I bet you that switch opened up that area I wanted to explore. I see you. Whoa. I can't...
can activate the switch. Okay, so I guess enemies spawn when you do certain things. I'm confused on what just happened, though. Something teleported, or something teleported in. And I was able to grab it, though I'm not sure what I even grabbed. Make sure we grab all the... Can I grab any of that? Those goodies? Oh, another secret with more rum. Though I can't seem to grab it. When this particular, uh video is done, I'm gonna do some research, or you guys can even comment in the comments uh, below in the video, and let me know all of what I need to do. Do I need to activate jump? Do I need to... I mean, what really do I need to do? Because there's been a couple things that I'm not able to do. Like that invulnerability secret. I am not able to get back inside there. Okay, well, something shot me again, but where? Aha! Uh -huh. You will die. All pirates, all pirate scum who is not a pirate like me must die. Well, I think that probably is all I'm going to do. I'm missing one enemy yet again. But you know what? That's just sometimes how it goes. Oh. This did open up, but I can't seem to grab it. Maybe if you're below 100% health, I'm able to grab it. Like I said, I'm going to do some research to see the items and whatnot to see if I am supposed to jump on that ledge in order to be able to grab it, or not, so... if that makes any sense. Miguel's Guns and Ammo. Oh, that's what this place was. Not really a bar, but Guns and Ammo Shop. Okay. That makes a lot more sense. Okay, I think I'm done with this map. Gorgeous map. I mean, so far my favorite in the... in the playthrough of the 18 maps. And I'm sure there will be more favorites to come, so... Let's go ahead and find the yellow exit area. And looks like we'll get out of here. Melee Island is done. Okay, well, those were the first two maps of the 18-map uh, wad that I will be playing. Um, these will be done intermittently in between the walkthrough videos, which, by the way, again, like I said before, and I didn't do, more walkthrough videos are coming. I have them coming, so I know it's been a long period of absence. I have not disappeared. It is just a result of just, uh, uh, just, just taking it easy for a couple of weeks, or maybe more. <laughs> uh, but anyways, we are back. I am looking forward to playing more of this, and what is the next map? Uh, Treasure, Treasure Cove. Ooh, look at that thumbnail image thing. Ooh, boy, I can't wait to get to that. Okay, well, I guess I will see you guys next time in whatever video comes next. Um... So until then, I'm Big Mac Davis here, and I shall see you guys in uh, the next thing that I do. So take care, everybody.